Boshenlo. Minister, it's great to see you. Uh, this is the minister of an outgoing regime, the Buhari regime, will be kicked out of power come by, 2019. By your wish or by God's will? By the wish of the people of Nigeria. So those people? The people, the now. people of Nigeria. So are you, your government has failed you us. Dreaming. You are a daydreamer. It's not a dream. You are a daydreamer. It's the realization that you what wake up to on February 15. What you? So of, what is your electoral word? My electoral word. Either in your my, 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 letter, my electoral word brought you to power you in 2000. It brought you to power in 2000. You you power in two, a politician. No, sir. Any other politician. Nobody even heard about some of you in 2000. You know, you know because you are inconsequential politically. I am consequential because I, I it was you, you came on power well, you came to power on my back. On which back? On my back. Whose back on the it? back of young people you, you who, who invested people a lot of you know who invested a lot of hope and aspiration. You invest more than me. No. The the investment we made in No. Come and make noise. No, it's not about noise. This is it's reality. Just a noise this was the same way. Jonathan people were standing in 2014. No, we, we the rest of his That's what I'm saying. What is your word? We have we, we can't sir, we can't be we can't be cocky about this. You are going to find out you, you, are, you, are, you are going to be shocked. You are going to be shocked 2019. No, sir. You are a daydreamer. The, 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 the Nigeria of the future is for dreamers like me. Yes. It, it's, it's, it's going to be for dreamers like me. Hold on a second. Thank you. Uh, can, can I, can I, we, we are aware that uh, you came to town yesterday. Yes. In respect of your quest. To uh, become president. What is motivating you? What is inspiring you? So he's but, like I, is politically motivated. No, it's not politically motivated. <laughs> the presidency is for people like him. No, you Let's see, that is part of the cockiness and arrogance of power we are talking go, about. Go and start from being a councillor. No. <laughs> I, go and start from being a councillor. I've been sir, a member of the House of Assembly to, uh, once. Before you became a minister, were you a, com were you a councillor? I was a commissioner to No, 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 I, sir. I, well, before you became a minister, I was, were you a councillor? You, you were a commissioner. So. The, the natural progression for you would have been to go to the Federal House of Assembly then. So, no. What I'm saying is that, sir. No, sir. I am. I've been. I've been at this for 30 years. 47 years, sir. Yes, sir. 47 years of age. Maybe. Maybe. I'm not. A, I'm telling you that I'm. A, I'm. A, I am. A, I am a giant. I'm a giant. I'm a giant that is going to kick you out of power in 2019. You are going to wake up. We are going to wake up on February 15. But you will not wake up on February 15, and you'll be shocked. You'll be shocked. Young people of Nigeria, 75 percent of them, will see your back in 2019. Now, Shawere, yes, sir. Publisher of Sahara Reporter. You were in town yesterday. I'm enjoying this conversation. I love it too. Today is not crossfire. Crossfire for you. Uh, basically, uh, we just tell our listeners and viewers, you know, that are tuning in as we speak, mm -hmm. what is motivating Shawari, the publisher of Sahara Reporter, to want to rule this country? Because that's what we are hearing that you want to do. Absolutely. Why? I have been around for 30 years fighting for the betterment of this country, first as a student union leader and, of course, as a leader of a media movement that brought the government that, that is, is today rubbish. into power that because we rubbish. reported consistently I have been in over time. Since you were born, sir, I have been in politics sir, you know I didn't. You know I didn't. You know I didn't interrupt you. You know I didn't interrupt you when you were speaking. Years I've been in so, you know, politics. So you see this. And I was already sir, lawyer before. The, I the, this, is part, this, this is the this is the paternalism of our politics. Talk rubbish. No, it's not rubbish, sir. You know, sir. This is this is this is the kind of arrogance, sir. president. Yes, and I will be president. No, it's not. It's not that we. I, I, I will be Order, president. Who made you president? You see, it's Order, be president you, of your Ife. No, I, no, I'm not from Ife, sir. I'm a Nigerian, and I'm going to be president. And you will, you, you will lose the election next year, and you will, you will go back to what you used to do before now. That's the truth. Yes. Yes. I'm promising you. I'm, I'm not God. I'm a Nigerian like you. Break, break. Minister, you are not. 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 Minister, you are not
sir. No, no, sir. No, sir. Were you not, were you not shocked that I'm 47 years old? Because you think I'm a small boy now? Of, of consistency? No. It is you people that are practicing divisive politics. You know that? You have, you have polarized this country since you came to power. Please, let us go back on air. You know, don't let him escape. Let's go back on air. Let's bring our ideas. I guarantee you, we are going to lose this election next year, both in your state and at the national level. Then you will know that I'm consequential. It's not about God. No, it is you people that are playing God. You are the one saying that somebody is irrelevant. You are the one saying that somebody is irrelevant in Nigeria. Did you pay for the? Did you pay for the airtime? President, my food. <laughs> 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 No, no, I started as a young man myself. Mm. I, I, no, I, I, I started as a, a 21-year-old guy at the University of Lagos. Sir. Before you, you waited to 26. I started when I was 21 years old. You're welcome back. If you just join us, it can only happen only at Fresh FM. That's why we remain <laughs> number one, Southwest Nigeria. Honorable Minister for Communication, our guest, this wonderful morning. Of course, he is also in live now, the publisher of Sarah Reporters Show. We're good to have you once again. Thank here. you. Thank I, you. I just, uh, uh, you were talking about your quest for yes. the rule of this country. Yes. Uh, people have also said your platform as informative in terms of investigative journalism that uh, you are also known for. People have also raised the issue concerning the fact that people use your platform, use you to set the scores. No, that's not correct. You, you want to expatiate more on that? We have always provided evidence. It's evidence-based reporting. You mentioned about the minister who was accused of a variety of things. The evidence was provided. He has not even responded to them. This was provided by one of his aides. One of your aides, someone with you. Did you contact me? You, when we have evidence, sir, when we have evidence, there's no point, there's no point wasting time. But I, I called, I called, no, no, I called you several times. But the same arrogance of power that you are displaying on here, here, is, no, no, you have not been humble today. No, but you are. By telling me that I'm inconsequential. No, by telling me that I'm inconsequential, you are, you are rubbishing my generation by saying that I'm inconsequential. So, um, let me also ask you, Shore, the, the, the quest by... Young and calling me a dreamer. Yeah, the a young dreamer. This idea of not too young to run. Is it part of what's motivating you? Or no, you no, no, no. That's, that's a sense of entitlement that I don't want us to work on. That okay. you have to be given power simply because you are young. Mm. You have to take power because you are responsible <coughs> and you will be responsible for it. And that's why we are having a heated argument here. Mm. Right? I have been doing this for 30 years. By next year, it would have been 30 years. These, we were the ones that fought for the democracy that they are enjoying you, you today. You spoke about the fact that you publish once evidences are made available to you. Yes. Do you try to cross-check those facts? Of course. Do you cross-check? I can come to you and say, look, I have you with... But, but, you, but you see the evidence. You. You, you see the evidence. Yeah, when, 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 when we say the chief, the chief of uh, army staff bought houses in Dubai, we provided the receipts. So the, and show that the colonel was depositing money in a bank in Lagos for a house he was buying in Dubai. When we provided, when they said they were hiring illegally at the CBN, we provided the evidence and found out it's the children of people in government that were hiring into the CBN from the back door. In terms of uh, ethics of this uh, business, oftentimes so when evidence is provided, like yes. you did mention, yes. is it not also incumbent upon you as a publisher to get back to the affected party? We do. Like I said, we do, but they don't react until they get into trouble. <laughs> yes. I have, I have, I, I have your telephone number. You know, yeah, I published. You no, no, I called you. I did call. I have sent you. I sent you text messages even before now. 
But because you think I'm inconsequential, you, you ignored me. <laughs> and you repeated that today. I don't have your number. You, you, do, don't have your number. Number. you do have my number because you actually sent people to me yeah, to call me. Yes. yes. So because you don't want to use your phone number to call me. I will make. I don't have any Mr. Karim called me. Uh -huh. the guy, uh -huh. And he said it's beside you because you don't want to use your number to call me. Because you know all of you are being recorded. Karim called you. Yes. And he said you are next to him. Karim called you only after you had published the rubbish. And I, I, and you I didn't about publish the rubbish about you. You did. No, no. I published you facts about you. Are, you have, you have, I consider also taking you to court. Oh, I'll be happy. <laughs> you know what Fela said, Baba? <laughs> Minister, you know what Fela said? Say, take me to court. I will open book for you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. The final word. I will there. provide the, the, you. The, the, you, you, you uh, yes. Show the final word here. Is one, one of the points that uh, the Minister raised here. Yes. In terms of the need for experience. Yes. The need for you to really have stuff on ground, right? For mentoring also, he needs to be mentored. No, not by you. <laughs> so, <laughs> what experience are we talking about? So, experience in stealing assassination. That is kind of experience that destroyed this country. I don't want that kind of mentoring. I don't want that kind of experience. This country doesn't need that type of experience. Excuse me. You know the electoral process in this country, highly monetized. Yes. If you want to become president, yes. uh, you have to campaign 774 local governments. Yes. Right? Yes. 36 states, mm -hmm. including Abuja. Yes. How much or what? It's not going to be about money this time around. Money failed them in 2014. Jonathan had the biggest watches, and he can testify to that. They are revealing them now. They were distributing money to traditional rulers in dollars. But could he buy them the presidency? Buhari still if, if, won, if, right? Eventually, Buhari won supposedly based on his integrity. Yes. He was the poorest person, supposedly, yes. to have won the presidency. <laughs> he told her he would declare his uh, asset. He the man refused. Right? See, today, he you come here and tell No, he never declared his what asset. He, 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 no, I not, not, yes, I he did not, he did not, he did not present his public declaration of yes. asset to the public as he promised. What, what he what only said that, I have one land in uh, Potako. I have one house in Abuja. But that document that he swore to, you know, transparently, he refused to provide it today. It's not law. What is it? It's morality. It's morality. Morality. He's bound by morality to live by his words. You are hearing the voice of Shawure, the publisher of Sahara Reporter. Final word from here. On which platform are you hoping to rule this country? It's going to be the strongest political coalition of all times. We are doing movement politics. The parties that are working and talking together will come out and will kick out the behemoth of APC and PDP, the people deceiving people, and the people I like to call all past criminals. You see, when they release their, when they release their list, they remove Obani Koro's name. That is part of the hypocrisy we are talking about. Yeah, yeah, they are yeah, fighting yeah. corruption, they are deodorizing their members yeah. and criminalizing people who are not members. What do you make? What do you make Didn't Obani Koro carry five billion me, me. to go and rig election in it? Why is his name not on their looters list? Yes, yes. Shomore, the final thing from me. Uh, what do you make of the initiative by former president of this country, OBJ? The the the, 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 the thought force, the it's, there's no there's, there's no thought, there's no thought is, force anywhere. It's called the thought fast. Oh, he's a candidate. Of no, no, the no. The I don't I don't believe in Obasanjo. <laughs> His thought force or thought fast would yeah, is DOA dead on arrival. He knows it. We are kicking all of them out. You know, sweeping them into retirement. Some of them will go to jail. Some of them will return, and some of them will go to court. There's going to be no, no. It's, you you will not be laughing by this time next year, sir. <laughs> You won't be funny. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, yes. You, you won't be laughing. It, 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 it will be funny, and the whole world is hearing us. And I want to be on record that they will see to the removal of this deceptive government by 2019. February, by February 15. God, it is God. You are not God. No, no, it's, it's not, I'm not God. And you are not God, too. Yes. And I'm not playing God. You are playing God. By telling me that I'm inconsequential, by telling me that I cannot win elections simply because I'm not a money bag. Test that in effect. No, I'm not. You see, the, 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 is the, the minister of my country that doesn't even know where I come from. I am not from Ife. Where are you from? I'm from Ondo State. You are from Ondo State? Yes. Too. You don't even know where I come from. Oh, how would I know if you were so... And you are supposed to be the, you are supposed to be the digital minister. Eh? Analog thinking. I must know.
I must know the hometown of everybody who makes noise all over. No, no, no. You, uh, you, why, if, if, if you don't want to know my hometown, you will find out. <laughs> On anyway, February 15, 2019. If you are just joining us, we are having a very healthy conversation. Yeah. Yes. Honorable Minister for Communication, Barrister at the Bio Institute, and of course the publisher of uh, the online, Google Online Media, yes. Sarah Reporters. Family, where do you see the future of news journalism as we see it, with your own experience, via online publishing? Uh, I give. Uh, newspapers, another two years, physical newspapers, they will be dead. You will only find them in the museum. Right? Uh, news is going to become decentralized, it's going to become digitalized, and people who cannot innovate will be out of their jobs pretty soon. Because the radio station as used to have it here will no longer be physical. People will be using small devices to transmit radio. And the biggest radio stations will not be the biggest building anywhere in the bad or southwest or even in America. The world is innovating every day. Things are changing and we must change with time. And that is why I am running. We have to innovate. Like I said yesterday, I have disrupted the media space. It is time to disrupt the political space. And they will find out on February 14th, 15th, 16th, and particularly on May 29, 2019. Um, the By that time, the minister will be called the former the, the minister <laughs> of the Federal Republic. Now that one would become a former one day. Yes, now. But at least I've been a minister for two and a half years of the age of a million. Doing nothing. Do, doing nothing. Yes, to your, to your, they, haven't, they, haven't con they haven't been able to finish Lagos about the highway for three years. Look, you didn't complain when PDP. The no, 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 no. No, you see, you don't. That's why I know that but you don't know my history. How it was when we no, no, no. You know, that's why I say you don't know my. You don't know my past. What is your past? So, you know, my past is that I was the one who complained so bitterly you are about the PDP. One who does everything this country? Uh, yeah. No, no. You are the heir between Nigeria. You know. Of course. Uh, of uh, uh, well, he, he knows. You but you know, this, this, and this is the problem. The, mo the, only one. the moment you climb on the back of people to power, I you forget them. You trample onto upon them. Suddenly, you have forgotten Sahara report. Why we are inconsequential. You, 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 no, you you I'm, I'm not. I'm not trying to. If I wanted to be minister, you, you, I would have been minister before you, before sir. With well, due respect. Before. No, 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 no. It's not about age now. You know, you could have been a PDP minister. No, no, I couldn't have been because I, I hated PDP with passion. You know that. You know, I hated PDP with passion. We have to bring this conversation to a close. It's been a wonderful fireworks. I think one of the best experiences that I've had here at Southwest Political Airport. And that's what you get when you see a fairy minister and, of course, the popular Sarah Reporter publisher. What do you get? Fireworks. All true. Honorable Minister, on behalf of uh, the Chairman of uh, Fresh FM and the entire Manic Minister, I must really thank you for always being there for us. And I want to believe this conversation between you and Shawari will continue. He, he's your brother, like Riley said. It will continue after he has been defeated in 2000. <laughs> <laughs> and we will come back to Swan to eat all <laughs> the. All the, 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 the conversation will continue in the courtroom where they will be facing prosecution. All of them will be prosecuted to the, the fullest <laughs> heavy <laughs> weight of the law. What a morning! Exclusive only for Fresh FM. Thanks so much for listening. Join me tomorrow on Crossfire 4 p.m. And Mayor Street Bay, as you can say, thanks. I'm out of here. <laughs> uh, oh, oh, I hope <laughs> you feel the burn. You feel the burn, Mister. Take take picture of the former oh, yeah, yeah, minister. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course, now. Eh, you can do it. Did the minister about the former one? The former. I want to say that we are free. We are not president. President Mufeji, sir. President <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Minister, I didn't feel heat, yeah. Heat, <laughs> yes, man. Look at my temperature. Ever turn this to your own, Ejo? The minister is feeling the burn. Let me need to go to the lake, you know. Emma, Emma, back. You're welcome, Ejo. 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 Let me greet everybody here. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, sir. Thank you, thank you. You Sorry, you just won't be disappointed. Thank you. This is the best, this is the best, this is the best. They will be, they will be disappointed next year. Solid disappointed. Solid yeah. disappointed. Yeah. 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 That's it. Even if you don't have the money, the youth will give you one one kid. Exactly. <laughs> no, money disappointed them in 2014. <laughs> Solidarity for them.